this project. Uh, the, the idea here is not to give uh, an, uh, all the details of this project, but uh, I try to give you the information concerning ICT and uh, informatics tools uh, uh, used uh, with it, this type of project. Can you come back on the first page? Uh, only a uh, note. Chambu is a quantitative model of thrombosis in a frequent anabolism and uh, uh, towards a more realistic model of the thrombosis. But you know, this project uh, 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 came after the analyst project. The analyst project was the FP6 uh, uh, project. And uh, after this project, we, we, we have seen that uh, it will be interesting to continue uh, to study the concept of uh, uh, thrombosis uh, or the phenomena of thrombosis uh, because we have seen that in the project we don't uh, really provide a, a, a real understanding of this phenomena. And uh, today, uh, to heal the patriarchal analysis, uh, one, uh, possibility, one possibility is to introduce or to understand endovascular prothesis inside uh, uh, the blood vessel in the brain. Uh, well, uh, so this project is a three years uh, project, and uh, we can continue. Yeah, to give you an idea of the situation, uh, what is aneurysm? Aneurysm is uh, we can talk about undesired uh, abnormal deformation of the blood vessel. And here uh, we can observe this type of uh, uh, phenomena of this type of uh, disease, aneurysm, by using medical imaging, uh, angiography, or MRI uh, modalities. Uh, here it's to give you an idea of what we want to do uh, inside Trombus. We want to try to heal, it's one possibility, and we have two ways to, to try to heal aneurysm. It's uh, by uh, the chirurgical treatment or uh, uh, endovascular treatment. Uh, uh, the, the purpose of Trombus is to uh, study the second, uh, uh, second way, that is to say, to do uh, endovascular, endovascular treatment. And uh, what we want to try to understand is uh, 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 it's what the effect uh, of the blood circulation when we introduce one stent or several stent inside the blood vessel in order to, uh, to try to change uh, the flow, the blood flow. And uh, by this way, uh, by introducing uh, uh, the stand, we, we are able to initiate uh, the growth of the thrombus, of the clot. It's a, uh, how I can say, it's a, a result of the coagulation of uh, the blood cell for example. Okay? Uh, <laughs> only to give you some details, uh, what we want to, to try to, to initiate is the coagulation of the blood within the cavity of the region to try to, uh, to, to, to form uh, a thrombus. And here, uh, more specifically, uh, in Trombus, we study one type of uh, stent. It's a new concept uh, developed by the, uh, one partner of uh, one partner of Trombus. It's EV3 Covidian Company, and uh, with, uh, it's a specific stent. It's uh, we talk about the flow diverter. And uh, the, the purpose of the flow diverter is to, to modulate the blood flow uh, to try to uh, to initiate the, the growth or the the formation of the troops. Okay. Uh, step by step, I come uh, on the purpose of this uh, workshop. Uh, it's uh, uh, one high city. I want to give you uh, an idea of what we want to uh, to uh, what are the challenges uh, of troops, the challenges of troops. It's uh, by using, uh, I can sympathize the situation like this, by using multi scale medical solution. Uh, using geomechanical uh, data, medical imaging data, and other data, we want to be able to understand the thrombosis phenomena within a local analysis, and also we want the consequence, we want to try to optimize the stand, uh, stand in terms of geometry, but also in terms of uh, uh, how many stands is relevant to introduce inside the patient. Uh, when, uh, only one uh, uh, one more precision or one detail. Uh, when we talk uh, about multi scale micro here we, we use a specific method. It's a Latin Postman method which allows to enter a different type of data uh, with model or with both model. And, uh, oh, okay, next, uh, next step. Uh, the challenges, uh, the challenges of Trobus. 
uh, it's still better. Uh, what we want to do is to try to understand the Phobosis uh, mechanism. And, uh, uh, when, uh, and, and from this uh, understanding, we will uh, uh, generate some models and we will implement this model within the, the code of numerical simulation. Uh, uh, the second point is to provide clinician a better tool to it in choosing the optimal stand. So optimal stand, the shape of the stand, the type of stand, and how many stands. Uh, provided a stand manufacturer with strategy for optimal stand design. Today, for example, a free company uh, built a flow diverter, but uh, this company is not able to, to really uh, uh, to quantify the efficiency of this type of uh, material. Uh, we have some problems with some patient, and uh, we have uh, uh, some uh, losses, if I can say. Some people, uh, some patient dead uh, after treatment. Uh, for example, after one week, uh, after one week, after one week after some vascular treatment, some people uh, die uh, with some uh, uh, it's a sort of uh, counter reaction. It's ischemic, ischemic. Uh, uh, problem and uh, people die, and uh, we don't uh, really understand why it happens. We uh, we have some idea uh, in some things on the vascular treatment. Maybe we uh, we uh, uh, you know inside the blood we uh, we have some uh, raw cell. We talk about uh, 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 endothelial cell, and maybe when we introduce a catheter inside the vessel, the blood vessel, we. Uh, 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 we, uh, we have some uh, endothelial cells which grow or uh, which we run along the vessel, and maybe uh, after a few few days after the endovascular treatment, we have some effect on, uh, at the level of small, very small vessels, etc. Et and uh, uh, sorry, just uh, I finish one point. If you don't mind. And the last, uh, uh, the last, uh, the last point is to provide an interactive computer to compare to the interactive tool. I will come back after uh, on this one. That is the uh, four main challenges of Trombus. Okay. Uh, now to, to be able to uh, uh, to to obtain the, the, the good result, uh, uh, to try to succeed in this type of project, we need a, a, multi a multidisciplinary uh, consortium. And uh, only to give you an idea. Yeah, you know, we can organize a work package. Uh, we divide uh, the project in work package. Work package one is for management and coordination. Work package two it concerns the biomechanics and in vitro experiments. Work package three concerns medical imaging, image processing for the main. And we have the third main uh, work package which concerns numerical simulation and modeling of uh, biology, biological and medical phenomena. And the last work package concerns the uh, 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 concerns uh, the integration and uh, in this work package we will deliver different prototypes in the project. We have two prototypes to deliver at the end of the project and also uh, uh, it's, uh, it concerns the transfer and the validation of the result. But you know, we have to be able to try to understand uh, the composition phenomena and to try to provide a solution for stands of optimization, we need a, a very multidisciplinary uh, uh, consortium with a different specialty. And uh, all this work package use ICT, use informatic, use uh, 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 tools to treat the data. Okay, next step. Hello, uh, yes, uh, I give you uh, this slide because uh, I, want, I would like to talk about uh, telemedicine, but also I would like to talk about uh, specific uh, software, Scovatem, developed by the uh, French company Covalia. And uh, you know, it's to give uh, you my strategy at the beginning of the project is to try to, uh, to work with a private company to give a, a good basis to, to the project. And uh, you know, for example, it would be very interesting to use this uh, tool because uh, in this software, we have first uh, uh, tools. It's uh, a tool for anonymization of data. And you know, to, to, to be able to work in this type of project, at the beginning, you have to decide of a protocol. We have to, uh, to, to uh, explain this protocol to a medical uh, med uh, ethical committee. And uh, when you have the, the, uh, the answer, you have the green light, you, you, can, uh, you can work with medical data. And uh, this uh, telemedicine software, What's very interesting for anonymization of data, but also to share the data between all the partners along the project from the beginning from now. 
Okay. Now, uh, to give you uh, an overall idea of what is a uh, Trobus, uh, if we take in consideration the ICT uh, side. Here, you can recognize the cover 10 uh, software. It's a telemedicine software, commercial uh, uh, software. And uh, this uh, uh, software uh, allows the follow-up of the patient around one year, because we uh, follow the patient uh, before endovascular treatment during endovascular treatment and uh, one month, six months, and one month after the endovascular treatment. And uh, uh, with COVID-19, we are able to, uh, to, to, to perform the, the follow-up of the patient all the time. And this software also with the interface between uh, data server and the different tools Mapoetic so developed for the trombus. <coughs> you can uh, see the two bricks, image processing, it's to treat the medical imaging data and numerical simulation uh, to, uh, to, 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 modernize, to, to uh, simulate the blood flow, to simulate the aggregation of packets, to, to simulate the formation of the thrombus. And uh, the last part, the back break of the project, concerning the city domain, uh, concerns the uh, uh, human mind interface. Now we talk uh, about the uh, collaborative online system, and we talk about the pipeline of application. We start from medical imaging to the end of the pipeline, where we try to give a, a good diagnosis. Uh, diagnosis is, uh, it, it, it is relevant to introduce a stand or not with this specification. And uh, what we want to provide at the end to the neuroradiologist or the neurosurgeon, it's uh, 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 an interface, web interface or interface on the screen, where uh, the neuroradiologist or the medical doctor will be able to have uh, an overall idea of uh, uh, the situation for one patient and uh, to be able to take the decision and to know if, we, if it's relevant to introduce, for example, the pipeline. It's a uh, that. Okay? And the uh, last one works. No, it's not exactly in the same uh, direction. Uh, I don't know exactly how to answer this uh, question, but uh, uh, the uh, Trombus will finish uh, in April 2014. And uh, today, uh, as coordinator, I think that I am able to, to, uh, to uh, transmit <coughs> some experience. Uh, I, I don't give details and uh, I don't make really uh, a reference to Trombus Consortium. Okay? But uh, I have some experience and uh, I'm expert for European Commission in different uh, call, uh, cost, FP7 project. And uh, in my ID today, if I want to transmit something, uh, even if it's uh, uh, new, uh, I think that the, the choice of each member of the consortium is uh, essential for the success, the success of the project. And because uh, sometimes we have good surprise, we have some friend, friend and uh, you think that uh, the, the good friend uh, uh, contributes really to, to the project, and sometimes you have some uh, bad uh, uh, result. And uh, uh, if I can transmit something, don't create a consortium with friends. Uh, uh, take in consideration only the, uh, the, 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 uh, the knowledge, expertise <coughs> of, of your future partner, future colleague. Uh, yes, for this project, it's a straight project. Uh, I can say today that uh, three years is uh, it's not enough. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, uh, during the summer, we, uh, we succeeded in the Amambo 2 of Trombus, and today we know that Trombus will, will finish uh, in April 2014, and we extend the project by three years. Uh, <laughs> but it's a really uh, short time, and today, uh, with a colleague of Consortium, we, we are uh, studying. Uh, to the answer to new call in Horizon uh, 2020. Also, uh, we have some uh, idea with transatlantic approach with uh, American code. <coughs> yes, uh, yes now, I come back on the first point. Uh, you know, uh, today uh, we work with the initial consortium, but uh, many collaboration, external collaboration, have been built along the project. Today we have some collaboration with uh, Harvard Medical School uh, at the Biological Point of View. We have uh, some collaboration with Tohoku University and the Rican Institute in Japan. And uh, we develop uh, many collaboration. And today we work a uh, uh, network with neuroradiologists uh, and neurosurgeons uh, in, uh, in uh, 
border uh, Europe. And uh, uh, last uh, uh, plenary meeting uh, uh, of Trombus, we organized a, a meeting with more audiologists to extend the database, etc. Et but you know, uh, it, uh, at the beginning I come from industry, but uh, it's the first experience with academic projects. And I'm very surprised of the, uh, how a project can evolve uh, after three. Uh, yes, uh, uh, I come back to sort of uh, fast uh, You know, very uh, uh, early we uh, have to, uh, to support the project by external uh, network. Uh, I think that uh, we will do the management of scientific scientists and medical doctors the non specific technique on strategy. Uh, I have no time to explain, but uh, I think that uh, you can understand what I, I want to say. Uh, multidisciplinary projects are the only answer to every question. You know, today to, to be able to, to understand uh, uh, the, the, the biology, to understand the, the different diseases, we, we need a short doctor, mm -hmm. doctor, we need a uh, engineer, we need uh, uh, people of uh, different domain. And uh, for me, ICT informatics is a transversal tool which allows to uh, achieve the, the, the objectives. And uh, you know, I come from the industry, and uh, I think that industrial partners are very essential in this type of project because uh, uh, it's not a criticism, but uh, uh, you know, when we work with uh, academic uh, colleagues and uh, uh, medical doctor colleagues, uh, uh, we don't have the same rigor, we don't have the same uh, manner to, uh, to work. And also, when uh, you explain to a, a scientific colleague that uh, we have a deadline, that is to say we have to provide a result in uh, six months, in one year, uh, it's very difficult to, to, to manage this type of problem. And, uh, so, I think that uh, I just heard that will be studying. Yes, sorry. Are you finished? Yes. yes, thank you very much. I think it's very important. All the stakeholders should be involved in the project because I think it's the only way to ensure the success of this project. So, thank you very much for your presentation.